So today I'm going to show you how to uh, take a uh, billet here on the grid here that I set up here and take these letters right here, FOX, and we're going to convert this FOX into uh, our CNC uh, machine over there using G codes. And the G codes are just machine language that the machine understands <coughs> using the XY coordinates whereby the machine knows where to go. Okay, so uh, I, I uh, made this. Uh, Simplify the uh, coding system here such that you can just use this grid here and lay out any numbers or any letters or any shape or object on here and the machine will know exactly where to go and uh, cut this item out. So I'm going to do this letter here. I'll give you a blank one. I'll give you, I'll give you a blank sheet like this and you would uh, draw your form, your letters here. Uh, equally space the letters here. <clears throat> so I normally space the letters from 10 to 30 as uh, one letter, and then from 35 to 55 as the second letter, and then I would put 60 to 80 as the third letter. So I'm form an F here between 10 and 30. I just draw some points. I've done this numerous times. And the letter, form the letter F, would be like this. I'll just draw the letter F here. And stop about right there. So you see the letter F right there. Okay, it's between uh, 30 and 10. Now you can come in here and do this right here so you can see it better. Letter F right there. So that was how you draw the letter F. And then the next letter would be the letter O. I would draw the letter O. I say draw the letter O from here. 35 to 50, and I would draw that letter O from here. Thirty-five to fifty-five. Right there. Or uh, 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 a square O. Oh, you don't have to make a square O. You could you could make it uh, form it well. For the G code, you with the G01 code, it would be a straight line cut. So for the other codes, for the for this art code, you would use the GO2 or GO3 codes, it would be circular or semicircular or clockwise or counterclockwise, but we're not doing that. We're just going to do straight line cuts. Alright? <clears throat> so this is the one, this is the one a student did here. Uh, well this one cuts at 15 and 45. So I'll do it the way he did here. I'll come, I'll come back here at 45 right here. And 15 right here. Make it do some type of so right there. This way this student did this one was 15 and 45. Okay, that's the O, and then the X, I say go from 60 to 80, and he did, they did the same thing with the X here. So oh, I'm going to put it, he made it here easier, he made the X between 15, I could have gone from here to here, all the way to the top, let's do it, well, I can go by the code here, I just make an X right here, see so the center point right there. So this is the X right here, F zero X, and <clears throat> over here, I'm going to create the coordinates here for the uh, points here. You see that the X, the uh, ten, I means I'm already F here as one, two, three, four, five. Six points here. The way, the, the way the cutter works is that it goes here one, point one, goes to two, goes to three, come back here, go up here, go without picking up the pencil or the marker. And the O, I'm oh, good here. So one, two, three, four, five, six points. I'll come over here, I'll label this one, two, three, four, five, six, illustrating this, the six points here. 
right? And uh, let's do this. The first point here is, is, is 10, 10. So it's be x10, y10, right here. x10, y10. Point two would be x10, y30. Point three would be, uh, let's see, x25, y30. Point four, come back here, would be x10, y30. Point five would be x10, y50. Would be x30, y50. Point, uh, the next point, the next letter here would be the letter O. Letter O, we say have one point here. Two, three, four. We start right here. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, have to close off. So one, two, three, four, five. So this is point five and one. So point one would be you say thirty-five and fifteen. X thirty-five. Y fifteen. Point two would be X thirty-five. Y forty-five. Point three would be X fifty-five, Y forty-five. Point four would be X fifty-five, Y fifteen. Point five, come back at the beginning, close off the O would be X thirty-five. Y20, I mean, X35, Y15. So, okay, one, two, three, four, five points for the, uh, there the, oh, then the point X, there the X over here, be the same thing, you label your points here. If you had to draw them, go one, two, three, four, five, okay? You come over here. One, two, three, four, five. Okay. Point one would be, let's say, X15. I'm sorry. <laughs> Uh, uh, X65 here and Y15. Okay, point two would be uh, X75 uh, and, and Y45. Point three, come back here, point three, would be X70 and Y30. Point four would be X65, Y45. Point five would be X70, and finally, point five would be X75 and Y15. Uh, so you got one, two, three, four. And the way the cutter works, it, it comes to a certain location, like point one here on the F. It is it's, it's elevated, so it goes down to the point, and it goes well, cut a, a straight line cut to point uh, two. Straight line cut, point three. Straight line cut back to point four. Straight line point to point five. 
39.6. Then it reaches the pickup code and go over here and go down. So there's two codes that precedes, goes with each one of these letters. The first code, is first G code would be uh, G00 C minus one F100. That tells the that tells the machine to go down to this point. I'm sorry, now look, 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 look. Look, look, look. G01. Tells the machine to go over to this point, go down, straight line, in a straight line cut, at a depth of, minus, of one millimeter, at a feed rate of 100, okay? So this is, this is uh, standard right here for every cut. All right? And then, this code right here goes right here under the first line of the code of each letter. That code right there. All right, goes right here. This same this code right here goes right here. Goes right here. Goes the same code. Okay. It tells the cutter to go to that location. To cut a straight line. From this point uh, to this point, okay. Then what? And then once it goes through all these points, it needs to go to the next point and it knows how to get there. So you got to tell it to pick up the cutter and move over there. And that code is uh, G zero zero Z fifteen. It means pick up the code, pick up the cutter, okay? Pick up the cutter. So. At the bottom here, you put uh, G00 Z15. This code would go here, here, and here. It goes three times, okay? That code right there. So, and then uh, you would have some uh, housekeeping uh, codes that go preceding all of this. And uh, you would put that on top of the code. Well, I'll show you how to do that. But and then at the end of the code, you will have to tell the machine the, that's the end of the program. Could be an M M O five and M O two. I think it said end the program or uh, cut the machine off. These two codes here uh, ending your program. Now, after we go from here. We put this code in the machine over there, type it in the machine, uh, in order. Let me see. We would type, can't read this, but you can see this. You type it vertically here. This, then this up under there, and this up under that in uh, vertical order. A. Paste it in the uh, editor in the CNC program, and it should print this out right here. Right there. So we'll see the machine do that. I want you to type the code in the machine. All right? We'll take a minute here to see that. All right, we're over here at the machine here getting ready to cut the letters that we just created on the board there. You see it? Getting ready to cut the. Uh, up as the code for it to pick up and that's the code for it to go down. That's the G0 uh one the G00 is he my oh my
simulator that you've done this for a lot of step in here. You can go through the online simulator with your code and see it cut before you actually put it in the machine. Oh, that's getting ready to cut the X, the final letter of the uh, project here. Once you can do this, you can, you can design any type of shape, object, and uh, really you can do this in, in uh, mind shape in a 3D model and, and software where it would convert the object directly into the G codes and you'll have to find it point by point. Solid works, you can use solid works in there, uh, uh, mind shape, any of those uh, software programs will do the same thing here. Okay, it's getting to the base of the X. Alright. It goes back to the starting point, and then we're going to have the machine cut itself off in about a second or two here. There you go, that's the end of the program. I'm going to get, I'm going to get the vacuum cleaner here and see. what we got here. Back in the house, whoever, whoever letters is being cut, that's who should back in the house here and see what we got here. Okay, you see the letter there. There you have it. You see? There you have it there. So, hope you enjoyed this right here. You can uh, use this to uh, pro the uh, process that I explained to you. How to form any letter, any shape. There you have it. And this, um, on the wall over here to the left here, you can see some previous shapes here. Well, there's some uh, objects that had been cut in the past there. So, there you have it. Have, hope you enjoy this project. Have fun.